Well, here we go. Heavy lake effect snow falling in parts of the North Country, and that will indeed be the case tonight and also all weekend as well. All right, let's check out the maps and we can notice the lake effect snow warning in play. Uh, Jefferson County, Lewis County, and also Oswego County. And notice, yeah, welcome to the party, St. Lawrence County. You're going to get a whole lot of snow. End time on this will be on Monday and even a winter storm warning in place for the pink. And that does include a good chunk of the Adirondacks. There you see the snow uh, widely uh, scattered right now. Really nothing all that organized yet, but give it time. This band will definitely organize and uh, really uh, concentrate on Watertown and just points to the south over towards the Tug Hill Plateau and extending well inland. All right, notice as we widen out the view, there you see big spin of the atmosphere. Low pressure located up towards Moosonee and around that, yeah, that counterclockwise spin and that's what's ushering down that colder Canadian air and that's why we're dealing with the heavy lake effects. No lake temperatures right now are above average in the upper 40s to around 50 to 51 degrees so that's really going to help uh, really uh, pile up that snow downwind of Lake Ontario. All right let's check out the future cast because this is rather interesting. Now this is a forecast model so kind of take it with a grain of salt but rest assured we will be seeing some snow on or about the city of Watertown and points north as well. Notice what happens as we kind of go through the uh, next uh, couple of hours anyways. That band shifts way down to the south. Think over towards the Tug Hill Plateau. There's what's called the southern bias to these uh, weather models. And basically what happens is early in the year when there's a lot of instability, meaning there's a lot of juice in the atmosphere, the weather models have a tough time depicting exactly where the heaviest snow is going to be. So I think this band is a little bit too far to the south. I think it's going to be Watertown and just over towards, say, Copenhagen. So think like Watertown Center, think Champion, think Rutland, even the city of Watertown seeing the heaviest of the snow. And notice what the uh, weather model does. It keeps everything a little bit too far south, just a couple of miles. And that's all it really takes, right, for lake effect snow. These bands are so narrow to see the heaviest of the accumulations. Around uh, oh, 11 o'clock tonight, around midnight or so, notice the band over Barnes Corners. I think that's a little bit too far south, and that'll play into the uh, totals as well. So bear that in mind over the next uh, couple of minutes while we keep talking. Around 7 p.m. on Saturday, there's that heavy band of lake snow pointed right at Barnes Corners. This is the actual, uh, uh, with, the, uh, with the future cast. This is the graph weather model. This is what it's just kind of spitting out to us as far as snowfall accumulation by Sunday at 4 p.m. And yeah, that's 73 or 72.7 inches of snow in Barnes Corners, 57 here in the city. We've got a closer uh, look at it, so to speak. So there you see the, the bullseye, if you will. Think right over 177. But remember when I was saying everything should be a little bit further to the south because of that southern bias? This is what we're thinking here in the Weather Center. We're thinking the heaviest of the snow in the whites. And notice that's uh, in the upwards, upwards of uh, five to uh, potentially more feet of snow. Think city of Watertown, very close to Fort Drum, over towards, you know, Natural Bridge, Black River. Uh, calcium getting in on the, uh, the bullseye, so to speak, down towards Adams. Uh, I think the heart of the band, Copenhagen. Yeah, that's where the heaviest snow is going to be. Rutland, Champion, so a whole lot of snow heading our way. And uh, it's going to make things rather interesting with uh, traveling through the heart of this band. You just don't want to do it. You want to definitely stay inside if it's, if it's snowing heavily in your neck of the woods. So definitely take it easy. Of course, we'll, uh, we'll continue to monitor the radar. and We'll keep tracking this uh, lake effect snow over the weekend. And we'll have an, a weather update on the news later on tonight.